Hi everybody, this is Barry at Rimmer's Music in Blackpool. Hope you're all well. Um, today I want to show you this. This is an X Display Faith FECN. It is a Faith Eclipse Neptune. It's an electroacoustic guitar. Um, absolutely gorgeous. Finished in this polished ebony. Um, I'll just take you around it. Um, here's the headstock. Move down the neck. Now, we've got a solid top. Faith guitars are absolutely great as far as specifications concerned. And we do really, really well with them in the store. Um, it's a Patrick Eggel company. Uh, Patrick Eggel, if you've uh, not heard of him, he's a, he's a world renowned uh, guitar builder. Um, and the good thing about the Faith guitars is that they, they're all solid. Uh, so in the case of this one, it's a solid Engelman spruce top and it's a solid mahogany back and sides so what that basically means is that as it gets older it'll get better um, you can get guitars that are laminate if they just say that the spruce or mahogany they're usually a laminate finish but this being solid it will improve as it gets older i'm just gonna oh look, just try and do that balancing the phone while just showing you the tune of that okay and that's the tuner built into the preamp uh, on the side of the instrument. Um, your socket is just on the bottom, just under here where the strap uh, goes. Um, and if we just move around the front, move around to the other side. Just try and show you that. There you go. It really is a gorgeous guitar. Now, I think that it's referred to, you have to check this, I'm pretty sure that it's um, a baby jumbo. Yeah, it's a baby jumbo. Definitely, I remember now. Let me just turn it round, let me show you the back. This is really weird, I'm not used to doing this. I had to look at the phone, I'm to look at the guitar. <laughs> right, <laughs> um, there's the back. You just move down, show you the back of the body. Now then, this is going to be really hard to show you, but there are, oh, it's got some marks on the back of it, but they're, hard, they're really hard for me to get on camera. Let's try the other side, see if I can get anywhere to the other side. No, well, it's just reflecting the bubble wrap. <laughs> oh, you don't want to look at me. All right, well, I can't pick it out. There are... There are marks on it. Can I get anything there? I mean, it, obviously, it's not really bad. I mean, I, I'd say, right, so if somebody came in and asked me, I'd probably tell them that it was, you know, when you're cleaning things and you get the skate marks on things. Can you, oh, well, there you go. Can you see a bit there, look? Can you see what I mean? It's just kind of at the, there, look. And there's, it's got them on the back as well, and on the front. But, as you can tell, I'm trying my hardest to get get them pictured. I'm not doing very well. But, there you go, let me just turn it round again. Oops. I mean, are you picking anything? Are you picking up the bull wrap there in the box? <laughs> I, I can't really see. It's difficult to pick out. But anyway, I, I wanted to just do this video just to show you um, because it's easy to take a picture of or anything from this distance and everything looks like absolutely spot on. And to be honest, the guitar is really, really nice. Um, but I just want to make you aware that there are some marks on it. Um, but. I think whoever gets this, it's a really, really great price guitar with a massive spec and you know guitars are meant to be played. So hopefully you like this video. Uh, anyway, I'll speak to you soon. Bye bye now.